Uh, and we took, the, we took them out for a period of time because of Valentin reasons. They, they were aggressive. That spawned a <laughs> Hey, you beautiful buccaneers. So pets are here and a lot of us who are insiders can finally breathe a breath of fresh air as we can finally talk about them. But it's not just pets that are coming. New emotes and shipskin liveries are also making an appearance and all part of the new Pirate Emporium. The Pirate Emporium can be accessed from the game selection screen and also within the game itself above the Order of Souls tent. Ah yes, the empty space that has had us all speculating now has a new resident along the lands. On September 11th, its doors will open to all, offering some cute furry companions for us to traumatize on our adventures. And with this update, we get to have a monkey or a parrot as our sidekick. There are two breeds of each animal type. For parrots, we have the famous macaw and the adorable parakeet. And for monkeys, we have the capuchin, which we can all relate to as a pirate, and the barbary monkey, which looks pretty terrifying if you ask me. Each breed of animal comes with a selection of colours to choose from. Every pet also has clothing options to make them appear even more disturbing. Pets will interact with your ship and your crew by either falling asleep, dancing to an instrument, cowering under a table, or finding a place to perch. They will also follow you around and feel like a member of your crew. And let's face it, they're probably more useful than an open crew member. New equipable emotes will also be available that'll give you a chance to better emphasize your pirate's emotions during certain situations. The coin toss emote is possibly my favorite addition as it will make for some great interaction between the crew. Also, new ship liveries will be added this month, including the Banjo-Kazooie ship skin, which offers hull, sails, helm, cannons, and capstan, alongside an updated version of the Banjo-Kazooie figurehead. And for the hardcore fans, you can purchase the collector set which offers unique sales and a golden figurehead. So how do you get your hands on all of these items, I hear you cry? Well, the Pirate Emporium is a premium shop. Much like you see in other games, the items here will be purchasable with real money, which you exchange for the new currency, Ancient Coins. The pricing for this actually looks very nice indeed compared to other premium stores in other games, with the highest tier being a little over 20 UK pounds, which is very, very reasonable. However, there will be another way to earn these coins in the form of ancient skeletons. This little fella is a rare spawn and will instantly run away from your crew. Killing him will give a handful of ancient coins for you and your crew as a reward. That said though, farming ancient skeletons will certainly not be a way of earning your ancient coins for purchases. It's considered more of a top up rather than a pint full. Rare have stated that ancient skeletons will be rare. And we all know what happens when they say things will be rare. Now, I know a few of you will be shouting from the hilltops, This is not fair! I should not have to pay money for a game I already spent money on! And you would be absolutely correct. You don't need to pay money for these items. You can just not buy them. You can continue to enjoy the game just like everyone else, you self-absorbed sourpuss ninny pants. <clears throat> this is going to be a great addition to the game and will offer us all a way to not only support the game's growth but also enjoy all of the new things to come. The Pirate Emporium will be updated on a monthly basis, bringing us an array of new ship skins, emotes and even pet species. Which pet are you going to buy and what pets would you like to see in the game? And what are you going to call it? Leave your answers down in the comments below. That's it for today, folks. Thanks very much for watching. If you liked the video, please go ahead and click that like button. And if you really liked the video, please go ahead and click that subscribe button. And hell, click that bell so you're always informed of CFB's news updates and other general random guff that I might upload. Until next time, everybody, happy sailing. Bye-bye.